What's up guys, Sick Crazy here. Today I'm bringing you guys episode number four of Squeaker Stories and today I'm going to be talking about the first girlfriend I ever had. So I made a commentary about high school stories, first serious girlfriend. But this is going to be the first, like, I don't even want to say real. Um, but like, it was just three, it lasted three days. Um, so I didn't really take it seriously because you'll see why in a second. So, um, real quick about the gameplay, it's a D Detroit domination gameplay, I believe, and it's, I go 39-3. to three. I didn't see the game, and I just saw my final score because I wasn't paying attention. Um, but, yeah, uh, I'm playing with Pat and Phil, so six Spartans and six Shadows. Um, and, yeah, and so you'll hear them talking. But anyway, let's get into this. So, speaking of Shadows and Spartan, they went to my school in 7th grade. Uh, this is after I transferred out of my first school. Uh, so they went to my school in 7th grade, and we were in line for pictures, and they told me that this Danielle girl liked me. I'm like, who's Danielle? I'm like, I have no idea who she is. And they're like, yeah, you know, the one with an annoying laugh who snorts when she laughs and then laughs at her own laugh. And I was like, oh, her. And uh, they're like, yeah, she likes you. And I was like, oh, okay. Um, now this started on a Wednesday. Um, and she's like, and I was like, okay, and I didn't really think anything of it, because uh, I didn't like her. And um, they're like, well, are you gonna do something about it? I was like, no. And then on Friday, um, we were doing the class picture, I believe. I forget what we were doing. I think no, you know what? I think we were doing the class picture on Wednesday. And then on Friday, we were doing the. Uh, class the the individual pictures. So after she had gotten her picture taken, and I was still on to get mine taken, Phil, who at this time I'm um, I'm still new to the school. He's my best friend at the school. He's still my best friend now, but I'm just saying, like, at the school he was my best friend and my closest friend. And um, he walks over to her and tells her that I like her too. And I was I I remember he told me that he did that, and I was so pissed. Um, one second, guys, I gotta cut the comment. So, anyway, he comes back and tells me that he did that, and I'm just, I'm just really pissed off at him. I'm thinking, why would you do that? I, like, I don't like her. I was like, you know, you, I think you have an idea of who I like, and he's like, well, I, I don't, <laughs> I think you should go out with her, and I was like, okay, but I don't want to. So, and, and he's like laughing, because I'm like really pissed off. And she's, she's all excited. I don't even know. She, apparently she was excited. Um, I don't know. I didn't, I wasn't there. I saw them walk over to her. I turned my head because I knew what they were doing. And then uh, they came back and said she was excited. So I, that's all I remember. Um, so, anyway, so anyway, he comes back and tells me that he did that. And I'm just, I'm just really pissed off at him. I'm thinking, why would you do that? I, like, I don't like her. I was like, you know, you. I think you have an idea of who I like, and he's like, well, I, I don't, <laughs> I think you should go out with her, and I was like, okay, but I don't want to, so, and, and he's like laughing, because I'm like really pissed off, and she's, she's all excited, I don't even know, she, apparently she was excited, um, I don't know, I didn't, I wasn't there, I saw them walk over to her, I turned my head, because I knew what they were doing, and then, uh, they came back and said she was excited. So I, that's all I remember. Um, so anyway, they were like, "Yeah, you guys are you guys are a couple now." And I was like, oh. and I'm, I'm face palming just thinking about it because I mean, this girl looked like Wendy. You guys know the national food chain Wendy's. She looked like Wendy, and she wore her hair in pigtails in seventh grade, which was the most immature thing to do in my my class. Um, now. Uh, real quick, a disclaimer before I go on. If she's watching this, I don't hate you, and you don't look like Wendy anymore. But anyway, um, she looks like Wendy, and I'm like, why? Why do I have to go out with Wendy? And um, they're they're all like laughing, and I'm like really pissed off. And um, so. Anyway, it was really awkward, and I didn't even have her number at that point, and so they gave her, they gave me her number. I, I guess I texted her after school, Dude, come and on. You were sitting right there, I was like, 
Um, I, I didn't have the heart to tell her, like, oh, uh, that was my friend doing that, so I didn't. Um, and then, so we're, we're like, texting, like, all day Friday, and I'm thinking, uh, the whole time I'm texting her, I'm thinking, I hate this girl, like, uh, I mean, I don't hate her, but, like, I'm thinking, why? Um, she's nothing like me. And, um, yeah, so... We're playing like truth or dare, or maybe it was, I don't know, it might have been just the truth game. And uh, we had to, you know what, I think it was two truths, one lie. And we, we were just playing that like all day, and I'm just finding out stuff like, she's nothing like me. And I'm just thinking that to myself, if she's nothing like me, why, why did they do this? Um, and... So, then she got ready to go to this dance. There's this local dance every Friday, or every other Friday, I think. Um, I don't know if it was every Friday or every other Friday that my whole school went to. And I didn't like them, so I didn't really go. And so, she was going there, and I was like, okay, have fun getting ready and have fun. And then I'm like, thank God, finally, she's gone. Um, and I forget what, I think I just, like, played on the computer for the rest of the night or something. And... Because this was before I had any video game, or I was into video games. Um, so anyway, like, I'm thinking, thank God she's gone, and I'm just in this, like, a state of relief. Like, okay, well, uh, now what do I do? So, they, they texted me, and she's like, dude, she's crazy about you, and I'm like, okay, oh God. And I'm like, I, I don't have the heart to tell her that you that this is your guys' fault. Because they, they, the original plan was that I would just tell her when I got home. I was like, dude, I don't have the heart to tell her. And then he's like, well, you want me to tell her? I was like, no, that's that's even worse than an idea. Uh, this is Phil I'm having this conversation with. Um, so he he's like, okay, yeah, whatever. And then, so we're, I'm going through, I, I, I go to bed that night, and she's texting me, and I'm ignoring her. Uh, and she's getting pissed off that I'm ignoring her. And then I wake up on Saturday, to, I think I have like close to 50 texts on my phone and like 30 of them are from numbers I don't even know um, and, and she put apparently put me in a group chat and um, with a bunch of people who I didn't know and well who I knew but I mean who I didn't have their numbers yet and uh, they started like bashing on me for falling asleep and stuff and I was like or they didn't know I fell asleep they thought I was just ignoring her which I kind of was um, but they, they started bashing on me for ignoring her, but I was actually, at this point I was actually asleep. Um, so anyway, I woke up the next morning to 50 texts, I read through them, and then I was like, Jesus, can a guy sleep? And they're like, oh, sorry. And then she's like, she started apologizing to me, and I'm like, no, stop. Then, I finally just, like, told her the truth. She understood. She was pissed, but she, but she understood. Um, she said, you should have just told me, you know, and she went through that whole spiel. You should have just told me, and uh, I would have been okay with it. But, like, it's, she, she, I forget what she said. And, and uh, so I told her the truth, but I didn't break up with her. Um, I, that was my mistake right there. Um, and she's like, okay. Uh, and then... She's like, okay, uh, she's, just, she's just like, okay, and then she ignored me for the rest of the day. And then Sunday rolls around, and this, that, this is the breakup, the, the epic breakup. I finally told her, I was like, I texted her. I, I broke up with her through text. I texted her, I was like, okay, I can't do this anymore, I'm sorry. You know the truth, I, I feel bad, and I'm sorry. I know you're going to hate me for it, but whatever. Um, see ya. And then I blocked her number, and... She 